Good morning. Welcome to the Wednesday morning meditation. This will be a one half hour guided meditation. It's appropriate for everyone, whether you have a lot of meditation experience or none whatsoever. So do stay. Let's begin with a reading from Metaphysical Meditations by Paramahansa Yogananda. And this is called, I have heard thy voice. Divine Mother, I have heard thy voice whispering in the fragrance of the rose. I touched thy tenderness in the softness of the lily. In the whispers of my devotion, it was thy love that answered. Our chant this morning is, Come out of the darkness, Mother. Bathe me in thy light. Continuing with the vibration, with the soul's longing, and offering this chant up to the light at the point between the eyebrows. Come out of the darkness, Mother. Bathe me in thy light.
so we can relax ever more deeply. Let's do three rounds of the double breath here. Short then long inhalation through the nostrils, <sighs> tensing the body, and then throwing out the breath through the mouth, short then long. <sighs> Completely relaxing. Again. And last time, a triple exhale through the mouth. Feel the feet flat on the floor if you're sitting in a chair. Palms are turned upward on the lap. And open the palms a little bit more to just feel the heart lift. And as the heart lifts, the shoulders melt down away from the ears. Draw them slightly back. Chin is resting parallel to the floor. And softly lift the gaze as if you were peering out from the point between the eyebrows. Allow the body to continue its, its progression of relaxation step by step. And as the body relaxes, feel that the spine is growing longer through the crown of the head as if it were the most natural thing to do. And as the body continues to relax, it can become more still. And now it's easy to notice the last remaining movement, which is the breath. And feel here as you bring awareness to the breath that you're greeting an old friend. Our breath has been with us since our birth our lifelong constant companion. And just notice the rise and fall of the breath like gentle waves on the sea. Allow its cadence to help the body relax even more. Expanding and relaxing, rising and falling. Allow the breath to deepen on its own here without any force. As if the breath wants to deepen and you're allowing it, welcoming it. Feel that with every inhaling breath, you're inhaling a sense of vitality, of new life. And with every exhaling breath, blowing out any sense of fatigue or tiredness. And let's get to know the breath a little more intimately by not controlling it in any way, by stepping back and becoming the ever watchful observer. And we'll begin by taking a long, smooth inhalation through the nostrils, a triple exhale through the mouth. And as the breath returns when it wants to, 
Begin to feel its flow up the nostrils. Feel it flowing down through the nostrils on the exhalation. And if your nostrils are blocked, you can observe the flow of the breath as the belly rises and falls. So we're not controlling the breath. Don't worry if it's even, deep. Just enjoy beginning to observe it. Just like you'd observe, wa observe waves coming into the shore and receding, having no sense of controlling them. Same here too with the breath. Relax the bottom of the nostrils, the middle of the nostrils, and the very top of the nostrils. And notice how you might be able to feel the breath more easily. The breath like two streams separate as they come up as it comes up the nostril and almost joining at the point between the eyes and then separating again on the exhalation just noticing not controlling The key to this technique is doing it with a sense of relaxation. There's nothing to make happen here or force. We simply allow and observe. the mind wants to control or judge the breath, that's okay. Just keep observing. The mind will settle through this technique. If you can keep your gaze lifted while you watch the breath, go ahead and do that. But if you have to choose between the two, stay with observing the breath. Allow the body to continue to relax. Now that we have a feel for the mechanics of the breath, let's go a little deeper, tuning into the inherent feeling quality of the breath by adding the saying, the mantra, Hong Sa. So every time you observe the inhaling breath, feel as though the breath were saying to you, say it silently, Hong, as in H O N G and feel the breath saying saw or say to yourself saw with the exhalation as if it were spelled S-A-W inhaling hong exhaling with saw we're going to do this technique for 10 minutes, it'll go by very fast, but feel you have plenty of time to relax into it and enjoy it. Hong Sa.
Whenever the mind wanders, that's okay. Just go back to the technique. Enjoying relaxing. If the breath has slowed down, if the pauses in between have become longer, relax into them and enjoy them. If the mind has wandered, that's not important. What is, is making the choice to go back to the technique.
Let's end this technique with a smooth inhaling breath through the nostrils. Gentle triple exhale through the mouth. We'll take this brief guided visualization into sitting in the silence for a few minutes. Visualize your heart's feelings as a boundless lake. Strive to see reflected in that lake the full moon in the sky above. Ripples in the lake's surface and deeper vortices churning below its surface disturb that reflection. This agitation is due to disturbances in your heart's feelings past as well as present. Calm that movement, not by suppressing it, but by seeking at the center of every ripple and vortex the undistorted reflection of the moon above. You do not have to work to develop divine love. The calmer your lake of feeling, the more clearly and spontaneously will love and devotion appear, reflected in the heart. Love is the very essence of reality. Let's spend the last few moments of this meditation time by offering a prayer in the language of your heart, offering it up to the infinite, knowing that every word of our prayers is heard. And in the stillness of the heart, with intuitive perception waiting for the response,
From pools of inner silence, I sip the sparkling waters of infinite peace. Let's close with Yogananda's healing prayers for world peace and harmony. Together, ten times we'll say, Lord, fill this world with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. And then three times, Lord, fill me with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Lord, fill this world with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Lord, fill this world with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Lord, fill this world with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Lord, fill this world with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Lord, fill this world with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Lord, fill this world with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Lord, fill this world with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Lord, fill this world with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Lord, fill this world with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Lord, fill this world with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Lord, fill me with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Lord, fill me with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Lord, fill me with peace and harmony, peace and harmony. Home, peace, amen. Thank you for joining. Um, I know Divine Mother has a sense of humor because I only do this guided meditation for a half hour a week and it happens to be the only time during the week where my neighbor's generator gets tested, the garbage truck, and the recycling truck all come. So anyway, <laughs> you just gotta laugh. So sorry for any disturbances and have a most blessed day.